Let's talk about the map and filter functions in Python and why I don't usually recommend using them. The map function accepts a function and an interval, and it returns a lazy interval, which as we loop over it, will loop over the original interval, and it will take the function we've given to it, calling it on each item in that interval, giving us back the return value. So in this case, we're squaring each of the original numbers. So you can think of map as doing a transformation, it takes each of the items, it takes an operation to perform, and it performs it on each item. The filter function also accepts a function and an interval, and it gives us back a lazy interval, which as we loop over it, will loop over the original interval, calling the given function on it, but it doesn't give us back the return value of that function call, it instead uses that function call to determine whether that item should be included in the resulting lazy interval. So in this case, we're only getting odd numbers because the filter function will only include items that it gets either true or a truthy value back from the function call of uh, passing that item into this is odd function that's given. So while the map function takes our original items, it includes them all but transforms them a little bit, the filter function doesn't transform the items, but it selectively picks out which items it should include in the new lazy interval. Now, the reason I don't usually recommend using map and filter is they can actually be summed up in pretty much one line of Python code each. The map function is nearly equivalent to this generator expression. Now, it's not quite the same. There's a little bit more that you can use map for, but for most use cases, it's the same as a generator expression that loops over an interval and calls a function on every item in that interval. The filter function is essentially the same as a generator expression that loops over an interval and calls a function in the conditional part of the generator expression to determine whether that item should be included in the new lazy interval. So if we were to use map and filter to take some numbers and square all of the odd numbers, so only include the odd numbers and square each of them, we could use filter passing at the is odd function and our numbers, and then take the filter object we get back, which is a lazy interval, and pass that to map along with the square function. So this lazy interval we get back as we loop over it, it only has the squares of the odd numbers. Written as a generator expression, this would instead look like this, square n for n in numbers if is odd n, or as a list comprehension to see what's actually inside this lazy interval, which now is a list, we get the same thing. So I find this list comprehension or generator expression version a lot more readable than the equivalent map and filter version. The map and filter version is a little bit inside out looking. We pass a function to map and then a filter object which has a function passed to it and an interval passed to it. Whereas here, this looks more like the English I might say in order to describe what it is we're doing, what operations we're performing. And in fact, with a generator expression or a list comprehension, you don't even need extra functions to call, unlike map and filter you can write out the operations right inside the first part of a generator expression or list comprehension and that last part. And in fact, I think of the first part is a, of a generator expression as the mapping part and the last part is the filter part because they're equivalent to the map function and the filter function in Python. So the map function performs a transformation on each item in an interval returning a lazy interval back. The filter function filters down items in an interval, returning a lazy interval back. Instead of map and filter, I tend to prefer generator expressions. The first part of a generator expression is the mapping part, and the last optional part of a generator expression, the condition, is the filtering part. 